All right, guys, welcome back to another DOA6 video. Unsurprisingly, <laughs> it seems that every time that I make a new video on the game, so new information just pops up the next day, just like that. <laughs> so, um, yeah, uh, this video is going to be a little more, more, a little bit more brief. Um, there's not as much stuff to go over, but that doesn't mean that it's not as important. In fact, this might actually be even more important than some of the stuff we've seen so far. But yeah, so um, let's just get right into it. All right, so the official site for DOA 6 got updated uh, with something pretty big. I mean, they gave the profile for Diego and all that kind of stuff, but they actually reveal the move lists of the characters that we've seen so far in the game that we know that are in the game right so they release the move lists for the characters and no there's no frame data or anything like that but uh, this is probably just for like the exhibition and like the free play uh, that's going to be at evo so you know that people know like the combination the moves and stuff like that so that's probably why they release the move lists but of course uh, to us the players that already know these characters we can just like go and take a look at what's new so that's exactly what we're going to do so we're of course going to start with Jan Lee here um, because you know fucking the entire channel is basically based around them um, so yeah anyway um, right here at the beginning uh, for the brake system the little box there uh, you notice something pretty interesting um, so you have your regular fatal rush and stuff but surprisingly it seems you can also do it from dragon stance um which really caught my attention because you you can do either hit uh, the first hit you know which is a high like a like a like a high hook or whatever you can do that from either like your regular stance or from dragon stance so that's that's honestly pretty big that's <laughs> That's pretty damn good because immediately that comes to mind. Oh fucking just like Dragon Gunner six H plus six H plus K fucking Fatal Rush. <laughs> and if you if you don't have meter and you guess wrong, fuck you. Eat that shit. <laughs> so yeah, I mean that seems pretty crazy, but maybe it's something different. I don't know. the 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 way it looks here, it makes it seem like it's the first hit, and then you can just continue. So that's pretty fucking crazy. I think. Um, but hey, I'll take it. <laughs> like, fuck it, I'll take it, man. So then, just below that, uh, on the next box for Unique Strikes, you see that Dragon Cannon, this is not like a big change, but I found it pretty interesting. Dragon Cannon, um, uh, basically just like, gently like, mainstream. You know, he's had that shit since the OA1. They made that just press punch four times again. <laughs> so... Um, I've been joking about this like since we saw some initial stuff in the game, but the, uh, this game, at least for Jan Lee, is literally just DOA 3. Like, <laughs> I know that they're trying to make the game easier or whatever, but I mean, that's a little much. I mean, I don't know. I find it kind of like charming, I guess, just to like go back to the way it used to be, but yeah. Something that I found pretty interesting there. Hopefully it's still like a plus guard break, please. <laughs> And then you kind of go into his kicking moves, and you see something pretty interesting here. Um, and it's the fact that now his uh, triple kick string um, is basically gone, like the old one. So, hashtag rip triple high, basically. <laughs> so, now it's called a double high step middle kick, which is that new string that we saw <clears throat> where he goes into 6 6 k automatically. Now, everyone assume that you would have the option of doing either one like the high or the mid but this is pretty surprising that they just straight up removed um the other move and now you're you're you have to do that now like you have to do the new string so you know i talked about that when we saw the moves like oh you're gonna have like the 50 50 or whatever now that's non-existent which kind of sucks actually so I guess it will still have all of views though because you you know you just stun someone you just do like at the wall per se you do like kk and then they have to guess if you're gonna do it or free cancel whatever um and for combo it's still gonna be damn good so yeah i mean it kind of sucks that you lost a move um but i think you've gained a better one overall so yeah and then we go into uh i think probably the biggest one 
um, because yeah, the, it, get, it gets crazy from here. Um, you still have the parry, you still have the dragon counter from Dragon Stance, which you never fucking used to begin with. Um, but uh, again, they simplified the input. You just pressed H on on Dragon Stance, and you get that. Now that leads me to believe a couple things. Um, they could they could just like make it easier, I guess, or they could actually be looking into buffing that, which would be amazing in my opinion. Because again, you don't you don't fucking use that move just ever, basically. Um, so yeah, that that's pretty interesting. But then, even more surprising than that, <clears throat> uh, just above that, you see the dragon cluster, what used to be uh, DS six P plus K, is now just P plus K, right? It says right there on the on the box on the right. It's the one that hits five times, right? Um, hopefully, that's still a thing stun, but then just below that you see that he has two new variations or two follow-ups from that so you have the dragon blaze and the final bite which is a sick name by the way <laughs> um but yeah you just press you just keep pressing p plus k and you get shit basically so that, that that's pretty interesting and whatever that shit is i have no idea what that is but whatever that shit is it goes from the from the five highs into five mids into another mid so it's like jesus i can't i can't begin to picture that that's gonna look sick dude but yeah so you do five hits that hit high then you go into five hits that hit mid and then you finish with like a big mid or whatever i'm assuming so that's crazy i have no idea what that's gonna look like and man i hope it's not horribly unsafe or something like that because yeah that would suck but still if you can use that in combos or like uh, yeah i just want to see it and i want to use it god damn it <laughs> i want to be able to use it um and then right below that you see that uh dragon burst which used to be his uh critical burst from dragon stands got changed to 6p plus k so yeah they like they switched him around which i kind of found uh, kind of interesting um but yeah i can't i can't wait to see what that is so um right above that you see that the new low from Dragon Stance is called Flash Fang. You know another pretty sick, sick sounding name. <laughs> I like these names, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but here we see that, uh, like we talked about in the, in the previous video, this is going to be a canned move. And you see it on the box on the left, basically. So it goes low into high. Uh, it's automatic, you can't do anything about it. So this has to be a natural combo. It cannot you cannot hold in between because that is literally going to make the move useless so yeah I really hope it's just a natural combo like 4kk or p6p um, that'd be really good again I think the game the the move is perfectly balanced uh, the way it is but yeah uh, hopefully it's that case they really really putting an emphasis an emphasis on dragon stance I feel which I'm all for but, uh, personally because yeah I mean Dragon Stance was good as it was but its uses were also somewhat limited you know very situational so <clears throat> I'm happy with all these changes really um, so yeah lastly you have uh, another big one <laughs> I, just, I don't know which of these changes is more important uh, honestly because they all seem really good man like I don't know uh, compared to the other characters like they're they're, they're buff down city for 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 Jan Lee is seeming more and more real by the second but yeah uh straight up just new throw dragon tail now there's there's a there's a funny story with this um i sent an email to team ninja somewhat like what like fucking two three years ago maybe <clears throat> and i basically just gave him like a list of changes for for Jan Lee or whatever things that I wanted to see I just did it like kind of like I was bored <laughs> I just sent them this email I didn't expect them to reply or anything they actually replied I don't remember with what um, I don't know if I can even find that email anymore um, but they were like yeah like whatever we'll take into consideration or whatever now one of the things that I suggested <laughs> was a move that was basically like 4-4k and it was the second hit of 3k 4k right so I wanted that as a regular move and the idea that I had for that, uh, for for that move to be called Dragon Tail, 
and I don't know I find it kind of interesting that now I see it right there but it's just something different um, no idea what this throw is gonna look like I mean it's no fireman's carry that still apparently belongs to Rig and, and Leon fucking hell <laughs> but yeah I mean if this is a this is, this is a, a 10 frame throw like dude dude that is that is huge <clears throat> so yeah can't wait to see it, it doesn't have a, a wall variation or anything so yeah I mean from the name alone I really can like I don't know I can't tell what it might be but yeah if you can use that to punish a little more consistently um, maybe to give you more O key, better O key or whatever that'd be really good even if it just does like more damage you know to punish things um, but yeah super excited about that so that's going to do it for this video guys um, again you can look at the official I think it wasn't the official DOE 6 side for the other characters there are changes for all characters you can see like their new moves and like the notations and stuff like that uh, I'm just gonna go over Jan Lee because you know he's my main character and all that um, but yeah there are changes for the other characters as well I was super wrong about Rick by the way <laughs> that character is looking pretty ridiculous um, but yeah so that's gonna do it for this time um, we have Evo going on right now so that's going to be insane hopefully we actually get to see some of this stuff um, but yeah can't wait so again thank you all for watching I really appreciate it and hopefully I see you guys next time with even more even crazier DOE6 news um, but yeah thanks as always guys take care cheers